So are you ready for some football? The Steelers are reporting to training camp today at St. Vincent College. It is their 53rd year having training camp there. And every year, some of the players try to outdo their arrivals from previous years. And today was no exception. Rich Walsh is live at St. Vincent with more. Hi there, Rich. Hey, Julie, like you said, it's the 53rd year at training camp here at St. Vincent College in Latrobe, but I would bet it's the first year a player arrived in a helicopter. Antonio Brown was not to be outdone this year, arrived in style, and made a grand entrance. Brown wasn't the first to arrive. Marquise Pouncey and a few other vets were here this morning. Most players pulled up to the residence for the next three weeks and unloaded their cars, SUVs, or trucks. Not a B. This is how Brown made his entrance. What up, mate? Brown rolled up in a Rolls Royce last year. His friend gave him the idea of a helicopter entrance for this year. Antonio, is that an entrance that won't be top? <laughs> I don't know if you top that one. I think if I put up in the chopper, you guys will think it's pretty cool. So, <laughs> so there you go. Brown's chopper landed on the practice fields behind the dorms with his girlfriend and three kids around 2 o'clock. Yeah, I'm fired up. I'm here early. Uh, excited to be here. Rejuvenated, uh, refocused. Um, ready to have fun playing the game. The Steelers are one of the favorites again this year, and one of the big reasons is Brown. Every year is always pressured um, to win the trophy, and this year will be a lot of added more pressure. So today is about uh, showing a commitment not only to my family, but the organization. You know, that I'm here on time. No matter if I came on the bike or I came on the bus or I came in the chopper, I'm just here to put my will on the stay, show that uh, I'm still a capable player. I'm still excited to play. Brown and his teammates just wrapped up the run test on the fields behind me. They'll have meetings tonight, and their first full practice will be tomorrow. The afternoon session is open to the public free of charge. Live in Latrobe with the Steelers, Rich Walsh, KDK TV News.